But let's keep rolling. Let's move on to some wide receivers here in free agency. Oh well, before we go there, real quick, we got Charles Sims True. on the running back. Uh, train and Terrence West on the running back train who neither one of them have ADPs listed don't even have a number and again I don't want to keep using this analogy but let's say Charles Sims goes to the Titans like that's a perfect complimentary piece to what Derrick Henry does in his game and I I like Charles Sims pass catching ability just fine I think he's an awesome pass catching back do you and he's going to change places and and get a fresh fresh new place fresh face Something like that? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you think that Charles Sims catches the ball l- less aggressively than he did two years ago when he was a really good PPR back? No. Exactly. He might have got hurt, and the Tampa Bay situation has been a little crazy. Doug Martin on and off, Adderall. Like, who knows what's going on over there? Charles Sims got hurt. Uh, Charles Sims played good for a couple of games, and all of a sudden, two years ago, coming into the league, t- going into the league year, he was being a d- he was a top 10-round draft pick. If you're on Player Profiler, you type in Dark was named, Charles Sims pops up. Whoa! So, <laughs> I'm just the, the the ADP is not listed on those guys. He's about to be a free agent. He's going to change teams and maybe get an opportunity. And and Terrence West, I mean, he's not listed. And Unless, if he if he can get an opportunity somewhere to be a to to be a first or second down back, he hadn't disappointed when he's had his chances for the most part. And he can catch a little bit. There's there's unless you play in a super super deep league, both of these guys will be in your free agent rookie draft. Unless he's on one of those teams where the player the guy stopped playing last year and didn't drop anybody because he right. stopped caring. Sure. So ninety nine percent chance Charles Sims and Terrence West, excuse me, are gonna be in your free agent rookie draft. And so when all the promising potential rookies are gone and nobody knows who to take you could grab charles sims and put him on your bench and just see what happens right there's no i, I think that both of those guys have had success in the league and yeah. there's no reason for you not to try to put them well, on the bottom of your roster just to try to you know yeah, electrify not, the bottom end of that bench it's not going to cost you anything and they're guys who have been successful in the league right it's not like they haven't looked good at spots and it's, it's, it's been injury and, and situation it's yeah, I'll add one more to the list. Form. Damian Williams is at ADP 289. He's probably going to change teams. He had some spots where he's looked good. I like Drake over him, but still, Damian Williams, again, these are these are guys that can help you out who have had success in the league that you know you should be looking to maybe if you wanted to add a little depth on the bottom of your team with somebody with upside, I think all three of those guys are, are interesting. Absolutely. Agreed. Zero dollars invested. Cheap money. <laughs> 